Ladies, good afternoon and welcome to our latest Facebook Live. Today we are doing the Pomodoro Reveal. So for the past couple of weeks what we've been doing is I've been frantically pricing and uploading to the website um, our items that have been delivered that Donna hasn't seen and then you get her initial reaction. The benefit of giving you uh, a little preview of this stock as it arrives is that especially with Pomodoro because ladies it is high summer it won't be on the shop floor for several weeks now so you are going to get ahead of the crowds and can select the pieces that you want before anybody else sees them. So if you are new to Artichoke and you're watching this on YouTube at a later date, please push the like button if you like what we're doing and subscribe to our channel. The same if you have just joined us on our Facebook Live, welcome. Uh, we can see that everybody's watching. Um, those of you who watch us regularly will know that Donna and I can't actually see what you're saying. But please grab a cup of tea, glass of wine, sit down, make yourself at home, chat to each other. If you see anything that you like, push the love button. If you have any questions, ask because we will go through the video at the end. And if your life is incomplete without something that you see today, ladies, but you don't do online shopping, please comment below, message, call 01760 or email us at sales at artichokecollection.co.uk. So, Doma, yep. Pomodoro. Yep. What do you think about Pomodoro? Um, I immediately think of dresses um, and I do that because I own, I can think of t two Pomodoro dresses that are my favourite dresses. I, I think I told, I had a black dress on a few weeks ago on one of these that wasn't Pomodoro and I said that this is my favourite artichoke dress. And then when I went home that evening and hung it up, I thought, no it isn't, that's my favourite <laughs> Pomodoro dress. But I, so can I alter that? The black one is my favourite Pomodoro winter dress, and then I have a favourite Pomodoro summer dress, uh, artichoke summer dress, which is from Pomodoro. Pomodoro. You know yeah, which I one know, I'm talking I know, about. Because you love it. You I call it a tea dress. It Why do I call it a tea dress? It, 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 is. Is. it is just gorgeous. Yeah. It does remind you yeah, of tea so, dresses. And it, it is the perfect fit, perfect cut of dress for me. Um, and um, so that's my favourite dress. So I think of... At dresses when I think of Pomodoro but they do everything trousers and also I think of what I do think of is when I when I went down to London with Sarah um, buying a couple of years ago and we went to the um, trades uh, trade fair um, the Pomodoro stand at that trade fair. bear in mind this was my first trip to trade fairs yeah. the pomodoro stand stood out yeah and it stood out because of color so i the think color. the color people the people on it were wonderful also yeah. they were lovely really lovely uh, and it seemed to me to be a real family-based company it is. it is definitely yeah and you got that feeling yeah um they were lovely and also but color um, so those those are the things that jump out yeah. at me. Yeah. So Pomodoro, ladies, is all about colour. Ah, it is. It yeah. is a uh, British family uh, firm uh, run by husband and wife team oh. Noreen and Hemant Puri, and it has been going now for about twenty seven years, and it is just one of the most fabulous um, companies to deal with. I think we say this about every brand, but it's like James Lakeland. It's just one big, fabulous family. Mm. So uh, Pomodoro is about colour. It's about summer. Their, their collection in the summer is always much stronger than their winter collection, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. But ladies, what we don't do is we don't buy sections of the Pomodoro collection. What we do is we buy pieces that are going to fit into the collection that we create for you. So when we do our unveil, which I promise you we're going to do in a second, 
it might not make sense immediately. It will start making sense when we style pieces and once we've done, we've got a Sukarno to unveil next week and then I think we're there. We're gonna do Sukarno next week, we're gonna do a new arrivals and then we're gonna start styling the pieces that we've shown you. So without further ado, we are going to do our big reveal. Donna has not seen these pieces because she didn't buy with me last autumn for obvious reasons. So her reaction will be genuine. So here we go. Here we have what, we, oh, there's one piece missing, ladies. One piece is going to arrive um, in a few weeks time. So we're one piece short. Okay. But this is Pomodoro Spring Summer. 21 starting at that end right okay so give me a few minutes okay so i'm loving this because um the shape of it i just love i love it and it seems to me that it's as soon as i pick this up this is a dress to wear with boots that i've brought yes, today yes that's why i said bring boots right okay so and i have a feeling that would look better on the hang it's on the body yeah, than the yeah, hanger yeah so i'm drawn to that immediately i'm not drawn to this because the pattern is wrong for I me love i love the shape it's very you yeah um i love the shape but the pattern on that is too wrong for me look if i hold that up you can see that you can tell it's it wrong wears for me. you yeah so but it's a gorgeous piece of oh, the and, the shape, and also the length and look at yeah. the pin tucking here can you see that it's got like the both these dresses are pin tucked across oh, the bust, and then they open and then there. it's an empire line yeah, yeah and this you unbutton so it can be a coat and as that, well. that's what pomodoro are good for they're good at the empire line dresses so your we, little tea dress has got an empire it's line it's got an empire well. line and it. it's perfect and it's yeah. you know it cover it covers all sorts of things so that's one for you that's one for me this is for you surely oh, this to god this, this is, is for, for you <laughs> yeah that's very definitely me Oh, I'm loving it. Look at the sleeve detail. Little frill sleeve. Love the colour. Love the fact it's got pockets. The only thing I don't know about this until I get it on, we've just been talking about the Empire line. Normally, this type of dress that I've had from Pomodoro in the past, the, it would be Empire line, Empire line from here. And because I'm very short, um, short in the body, I just have to hope that that line is in the, uh, the waistline is in the right place for me because it and I won't know that until I try it on. And we've so, got that coming in in mink, so that is still to come. So two colours, mink, mink, mink and yeah, that has so That is yet. a definite for me. Um, you can see how nervous I'm because I love this collection. I just want everybody else right. to. That is definitely you, and I you know it. why. It's the print. Yes. It's the print on me. But don't you think that print is okay if it be away from your face? Do you think that's worth trying? No. No? You no, think that's going to be too I, big? I, I, that, that's, I, that's too much for my, that's too much for me. Yeah, too much. So th is this a shirt waster? So it's, it's a button through. It's a button through, but again, it's got this empire line and then it's got a tiered skirt. Oh, it has. Yeah. Yeah, it's empire Can you see? line. Yeah. And it's got the tiered skirt. Which is, so for a full length dress, for a, for a maxi dress to have an empire line, that is that 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 that's going to be so flattering on so many people because if that was the waist, then the thing about waists is they can be in the wrong place for people. But as an empire line uh, for a maxi, it's it's more flattering, isn't it? Yeah. Right. So that's um, a you. Is that the same dress? So that, different... that no, this is a different skirt. skirt. So this is a zebra print skirt yeah. in khaki. Oh my god, I'm loving the colour. I'm loving the colour. Give it a whirl. You might surprise yourself. It, it's the I do wear maxi. That's the wrong maxi for me. But I will try it Give to, it a, to yeah. show. I'll see. I might not come on camera. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <clears throat> this might have to come home with me. Well, there's, you haven't seen the other two colours oh, yet. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right. Well, you know... You know that's that colour is no, although I do like yeah, that colour. Yeah, because yeah. it's not yellow yellow. No, it's, it's gold. Long, it's like a lot. Are they calling it lime? Oh my but it's god! Like icing that like colour. I think this colour. It's sort of got a green tinge to it. Can you see? You might have to try on three. It's or not. I, I I don't wear yellow, but that is not yellow. No, they're calling it lime. It's lovely. Oh my god! I might have to try all three. 
So these are all the same. They're the same cut, but oh three God. different colours. Okay. So they're a Ooh. linen dress. Yeah, okay. One of these is coming <laughs> home with me. So try yeah. all three on. I'm going to try all and three. And they've got the patch pockets, the pockets. And they've still got that little Empire Line waist. Got the Empire Line. Slightly lower, but it's still a high waist on. That actually, I'm looking at this, and this actually might be the perfect dress for me. It's ticking all the boxes for what I look for. It's got the notch neck, which I'm, which I is a, what something I look for. The pockets, the empire, and then it's straight. So that that might be. Let's have a look what it's made of. Sarah linen. says it's linen. Is it pure linen or is it a mix? I think it's pure linen. Let's have a look. It's garment dyed as well. So these these colours. It's a hundred percent linen. And, and the colours will fade because they're garment dyed. Ah. This is very typical Pomodoro. Loving it. They can't see it, Donny. Oh, you? sorry. You can't see it. <laughs> well, I've got to look at it before I talk about it. Right. This colour is a really good colour on me. So this is a colour that I buy a lot of. So that, it, what size is this? This is, this is looking a more generous cut. So what size is that one? Eight, right, okay, so I've got an eight and a ten, so that's why this one was looking a more generous cut, so it looks to me that's going to be a close-fitting dress, but this is looking more generous armpit to armpit. I like the fact it's got the button-up sleeves, because that's how I would wear it, I wouldn't wear them down. Um, can be wear as a coat as well, be... that's what I liked about yeah. it, dress um, under coat. So the colour I'm loving, I'm just going to open it. Has it got pockets in the side? No pockets. No pockets. So how many have I, am I allowed to try You on? can try as many as you want. Right, because I think this needs to be, I won't know about this till I try, try it on. on. Yeah. This seems to be a lovely holiday dress. Right, I'll try that on. And that's the smallest size we've got that that's in? That's the smallest size. So the smallest yeah. size is the 10. Right. Loving the print in this. Can you see? I'm having a look at the same time. The notch V-neck is lovely. This is, there's no, um, there's no waist or empire line. It's just, it's just um, an overshirt, shirt waster. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, so shirt waster. Oh, I'm really liking that as well. I'm not sure if that will like me, that pattern. That's one that I'd have to try. I don't know about that one because black and white, I normally, I wear. Yeah. And I like black and white. This is so, more of an ecru though, isn't it? It's more of a creamy colour. And But animal prints, I can wear. So I honestly don't know about that. But I sort of want to try that one as well. Um, That's the skirt, but you, you like the green skirt. This is the black. This is the black and ecru version. Yeah, I like. I'm gonna like that. That would look great on Christine, the other girl that works here. On me, that is not a good. Um, it's it, it's not That's a good me. shape. It's not a good shape on me. I just know. It's loving those, but I have a feeling those won't love me. But I'm loving this um, black and white. These are just little tops that we've got to go with everything. They're little vests of the they're same They're just little colour. vests. Mm. Gonna, yeah, the little Lovely stones. colours, ladies. That's going to look fabulous underneath that dark denim jacket. Yeah, loving those. So, good colours. And then just a couple of overshirts. Well, I'm drawn to that colour. So, that's just an overshirt. Lovely bluebell colour. Great notch neck again. Uh, the back is longer than the front, and that is a really nice overshirt, and that's 100% linen. So a lovely um, linen overshirt. Yep. Have I got anything to try that on with? We'd grab some jeans, couldn't you? Right, so I... Which colour one would you want to try I don't on? mind, I don't mind. You, you're, you're first. I don't know which colour. Whilst you're chatting, I'm going to go and pull down the other one, because that's where right, I'm going Right, which colour for me? Okay, so those are... Um, those are what I'm going to try and those are what I'm going to leave for Sarah to try. Right, so I'm going to, I don't know what Sarah's gone to get, so oh, this is my pile. Just give me two 
two sets to get okay. down the other row because we couldn't get it we couldn't get it all okay. on one row. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try on I'm gonna go backwards here. because and try everything on with these shoes that I've got on and then I'll try that dress on last because I will put that on with my boots. Okay. Right. So um Donna's disappeared and she has taken most of the Pomodoro collection <laughs> with her. Which ladies is a good sign? I'm just gonna come up to the camera and see what you're asking so did you get the animal print trousers in the green no we didn't we may are oh. so ladies um i've had a chat with sonia at pomodoro she has told me that from uh april the 12th i think she said she will know if we are able to get more colors more sizes in but she can't guarantee that there is much stock behind this and we we're actually finding that out the hard way from um tinter because we've tried to reorder on some of the more popular runs um and we're not getting very far so my advice is ladies if you see something today that you love buy it because this is such an exceptional year the brands have really struggled for the past year so they haven't done their usual overruns donna is back with the first dress and what oh my gosh and the first dress was made for me it was made for me and if somebody else wants it you're going to have to be able to get another one so all of these items well you need to you check got, which color you want today but all of these items that we're showing today have you got stock behind them or are they not just every be? size not every size that's right, why okay. i'm saying some we've got stock behind yeah. but not every size so i was a little bit worried because sarah had pulled the eight and my, my dresses at home are a size eight and I, I have to get small eights usually in a dress. But I must admit, after the other day wearing that white, um, the white um, sleeveless reveal from, what was You're it? Right, it's the tinto, yeah. tinto belt. I was a little bit worried whether I'd get my boobs in this one because it was a little bit tight that this dress was made for me. The only thing is, is, oh, colours. I right, just go love the all next the next one on. So, yeah, so, so it's a very... Dress. I'll turn around so we can see your but waist. But what I want... Look, yeah, it looks fab. It's, turn around so it's they can see your back. very fitted, ladies. It's fabulous. And also, it's going really into Donna's waist. So, mm. I'm not sure, ladies, you need to be very tall for this dress. Yeah, it's really fitted. So, it's it, it's a it's a good fit, fitted dress. So, yeah. if you've got... Yeah. Right, I'm going to try the other colours on. And can you shout over how much they are? Then I can tell the ladies about this particular yeah. style. They are it's 79 for this one. So this is, and I can, what's it called? It's can you shout out for what it's called? It on because it's so fitting. <laughs> <laughs> can you see what it's, what it's called? Right, it's called the safari dress. So this is a safari linen dress, ladies. It's online in size 8 to 16. As we've seen on Donna, it's fairly fitted and I would say fairly true to size. We have it in the three colours. We have it in black, which you've seen. We have it in khaki and we have it in lime. Um, and you'll see when Donna comes back, it's got the two patch pockets on the bust. Now, Pomodoro is the only brand that I will buy from where patch pockets are placed on the bazooms. Normally, if I see a piece when we're buying and it's got patch pockets on the chest area, I walk away because invariably they're over your nipples. But they get these pockets in the right place. They've got them place, in the right place. And they yeah. always do. They yeah. always, always yeah. do. Now, if the patch pockets were any lower, I yeah. wouldn't wear it either, especially with these buttons. Mm. Yeah, no, so I'm loving I. I, I wear a lot of khaki. Yeah. So the three main colours that I wear are the um, ecru colour of the dress that I'm going to wear later, khaki um, and black. So I'm loving this. Yeah. And it's just below the knee, so it's a nice length. It goes over your hips. Yeah. I think you have to have an hourglass figure for this, ladies. If, like me, you've got a tum and no hips, 
forget it. Mm. I don't think it's going to work. No, no, because it is really fitted. And I mean, it's got the notch neck here, so that's very flattering on the bust line. I mean, to get it on and off, I literally had to undo all the buttons. Yeah. Yeah. So it, it's very fitted. So we're we getting the thumbs up from you. Which colour should you have, well, ladies? Well, I'm really interested to try this other colour. I've never seen that colour before. Yeah, it's really it's gorgeous. Unusual. Yeah. I think you're going to look lovely well, in it. Right, I'm going to go back to questions. Um, hi, Tuppence, lovely to see you. And you, Jerry. Kim Clayden saying that the dress looks great on you. Linda and Darch is watching. Hi, Linda. Hi, Linda Harrison. Anita's watching. I don't want to push the screen and make it go up because last time I did that, we lost our video. Viv Oldland saying black. That's what she likes so far. Um... Yeah, I liked you in the black, actually. Anita Warns is watching. Hi, Anita. Ooh, like oh, she's loving the yellow. This is really unusual because I don't well, we wear We mustn't yellow. call it yellow because it's called lime. Yeah. And I don't think it is. It's not yellow. It's, it's not, not a yellow. Yeah. And actually, it's, that's really, that's a lovely colour. It is a gorgeous colour. It looks fab on you. The... Is it gaping slightly? Oh, is it? No, I think no. if you pressed it, none of these I, items have been steamed, yeah, ladies. We've been does, too busy. Well, I've I been think too busy. this does need pressing here. Yeah. Um. So yeah, I like this colour. I still think though, I I go for black every time. I feel, you know, when we talk about do colours suit you? Yeah. I don't think this doesn't suit me, but it's about what you feel. Comfortable I feel in. I feel better in black. Mm. Yeah. So I do love this colour. I think it's gorgeous. It looks but I think I feel better in the black. Right, so we've seen that dress, so the safari dress. Yeah. What shall I go for next? So I'll go for the similar next in the okra. Okay, so what are you going for next? You're going for the stone colour. So, ladies, sorry, um, next Donna is oh, going for the... Um, let me go and grab it, actually, so that I can tell you. This is... I'm going to take back what you're not taking so that I can tell you, if you don't mind. This is the uh, bib long shirt... I'm going to make you grab them as you go, so oh, I know right. what okay. I'm talking about. Yeah. This is the, the bib long, I think I've called it crochet bib long shirt. Um, again, it's 100% linen. Oh, we've, we've told you the price on the others. This one, I think, is £95, but I'll check the label when Donna comes back. It's 100% linen. The reason I bought it is because actually I think it will be fabulous on larger ladies as well as little ones. Um, and also because of the versatility, although it's an investment piece at £95, it can be unbuttoned all the way through so that you can wear it as a coat as well as a dress or if you're not that confident right. as um, a tunic, and that is too big for you. Right. That's not so doing this much is for you at all. far too big for me. Look, it, it's looking sat like. Yeah. This is a 10, the other dress was an eight. I So even though I looked at it and I could tell it was roomier cut. So this is a definitely... Look, a, pull it in. Yeah, this is definitely a roomier cut. The other thing about it, I've got black underwear on. You mm. cannot wear black underwear in this. But some are, who's going to be wearing black yeah. underwear? So I love the colour, but it's far too big on me. I would, and they, this is the smallest. This is the smallest. So we've ladies, got. if you're an eight, don't even think about this. This is a large ten. I think this is more like a, this is a ten twelve dress. Because yes, it's not fitted. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So yes, so ten twelve. But it's lovely. I like the way it um, is more. It's very like a shirt dress. Yeah. You know. Yeah. So yeah. So I'm loving the colour. It's just too big. Okay, so ladies, yeah. this is a generous. How cut. much is it? So this is a. Uh, it is ninety five pounds. And it, uh, it, this would be a great um, holiday dress yeah, when we go on Really holidays. easy to wear. Yeah. 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 So what we might do if we have time is I might nab the 14 and I might oh. put it on. I need to take what are you going to do next? I'm going to do this one. Okay, so can you just shout what that yeah. is? So now this Donna is, is trying on the uh, tensile dress. So if you go online, she's just about to try on the tensil dress, which I think when I saw it was £78. It is £79. £79. We've had the denim colour delivered 
uh, we haven't actually received the mink. I'm rather hoping we are going to get the mink because it is the most gorgeous taupey brown colour um, that I think would be uh, easy for a lot of skin colours to wear. Oh my God, right. I love it. Yeah, I need you to do it up at the back. This is easier to get into than the safari dress because it's a zip all the way down. So this was a lot easier to get on and off. Um, I honestly haven't looked at it, so I think I need to just... I forgot to put the mirror there, didn't I? Let me go and get the mirror. Right. You, you chat. Let I wouldn't be surprised if... I think I'm too booby for this because what I think's happening is my boobs are making it pull too much. So if I went up a size for my boobs... Hang on, let me whistle behind you. Yeah. <laughs> it, would, it wouldn't fit me everywhere else. And What about if you hook your tips up? I hook my tips off. Yeah, it might just be the bra I I've got. On. Bra. So I might, I might have the wrong bra on for this dress, but the it's finishing in the right place. I think if you just hook your. I think up, I just need a need different a better bra. I need a different bra on. Well, let me come. If I just pull them up. No, don't pull them up. <laughs> Why I pull my tits off? Pull my tits off. Look. That's yeah, they're in the right place. Be. Now yeah. they're in the right place. Right. That makes a huge yeah. amount of difference. Or I go back to my pre-COVID uh, weight. Yeah, but I'm loving it. So this is what, tensil? This is tensil. So tensil is, um, I think it's made out of trees, isn't it? It's one of those yeah. eco fabrics. Very, very soft to wear. So if you want a dress that's below the knees, this is below the knees. I'm loving the sleeve detail. So for all those ladies who want it below the knee, you want it, um, you want a sleeve, you want to cover up your arms, that's what we hear a lot. It covers up the arms. So it ticks the boxes. Yeah. It ticks the boxes on length, it ticks the boxes on um, the, uh, the sleeve, the zip at the back, and, and the lower and the waist pockets. means you can be taller and wear it as well. So, ah, yeah. yes. Yeah, so yeah. I don't think that's restricted just to little ladies. No. Yeah. Whereas the denim dress, I think if you were tall, it's all going to be too it's high. Be unless too you're high. very, very yeah. short-waisted like me, yeah. which, you know, my waist is just yeah. below my chest. Yeah, so the safari, yeah. safari dress for shorties. And it's lovely to wear. It's really it's lovely, lovely to wear. It's lovely, lovely soft yeah. fabric. You look yeah. really pretty yeah, in that, no, Donna. Really Change lovely. your bra. I love it. Change your bra. Right, there we go. Listen next to one. your own lecture, girl. What are you going into next? Uh, um, I need something to wear. Why don't you do that one then? Do you know so what? I can dig out jeans. No, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this one over this dress. Okay. Yeah, I'm just going to do this now. So this as a an overshirt I can do now over this dress because these colours go nice together. I might not wear it with this dress, but it will give you... Imagine I've got jeans on... Um, I would wear this with jeans and a white t-shirt. Yeah, and it would look fabulous. And it would look fabulous with Let me these. just see uh, how much it is. I've got the blue one here. Right, so this, ladies, is the linen overshirt in coral. We've also got it in ocean. The blue is called ocean. You've got a size 8 on. Ah, I've got a size 8. It's a very roomy 8. And very handily. It hasn't got a price on it. I think this is a this is an eight ten. This is more like a small ten. So um, if you're wondering what size to to, if you're between sizes, go for the smaller size. I would, and it hasn't got a price on. Did you say? No, I oh. think it's about fifty sixty yeah. quid. And it feels really, it's really lovely. It's yeah. slightly longer at the back, and that is going to look great with. Um, Jeans with white jeans is going to look fabulous. Yeah, yeah. and I'm or loving over both. white shorts in the summer. That would look really, over really good. Yeah, and I'm loving both the colours actually. Yeah, I love that colour as well. Right, so that's that. So do you need me to dig, dig you out some jeans? Are you okay with? What no. Are you do so next? what am I wearing next? That so I've one. Got, I've got the dresses. Yeah, and I'm putting a t-shirt with that. Yeah. Right. So okay. you, know, you don't mean you don't. Nobody need me to find you anything. No. Nope. Fine. No. Nope. So what okay. should I go for next? This one. Let yeah. me just see what this is. So ladies, online, this is uh, the 
crinkle zebra overshirt. I just so need again, you to do the zip, please. for most people, this is going to be a shirt. I know Donna's going to be able to wear it as a dress. Ah. But okay. not everybody's going to be able to do it. And it's in 100% viscose. And it's that crinkle viscose, which is so easy to wear. While she's getting changed, I'm going to go back into the camera to see if you have got any questions. Maggie's watching. Hi, how are you? So, Sandra. Robin's watching. Hi, how are you? Marie Faber says she loves the coral blouse. How much is it? Has the coral one got a price? No. Oh, oh, I didn't know. We didn't look. Yeah, sorry, that's my fault. I forgot to price them yesterday, but they are online. So if you have a little look online, um, you'll be able to find out. Um, and now Donna's coming back with the overshirt on. She's wearing it as a dress and it looks great. It feels lovely. Yeah. What it size am I in? So you are what in size is the it? 10. Yeah. And this isn't priced either. Right. Um, so the smallest this comes in is a 10? Yeah, you've got all the smallest sizes. I've got sizes. all the smallest sizes. I'm just going to show you, put that sleeve up to show you that it does have that facility where you can hook a sleeve up which is very important for me because well I can't do that without my glasses on right I would be able to fit uh, and if this came in an eight and I wanted it as a dress I would buy the eight however it doesn't look too big on me but the reason I'd buy the eight is because it would be a little bit more fitted there but and on the shoulders. On the so shoulders, yeah. So yeah. I think if I was wearing this as a dress, I think the eight would look better on me. Um, that said, I'm I'm loving it. I think I can wear the pattern. I love I love monochrome. I love black and white or off white as this is. Um, and so yeah, I'm really loving that. Right, it's just touching my knee. So if you're any taller, it's going to be too a, short for it's a dress. Going to be too short. But for it a dress. is actually supposed to be an overshirt. Yeah. So this is supposed to be tunic length. Yeah or um, worn undone over t over a t-shirt with jeans and trousers yeah. so this so is... that's how we'll style it once we get on to our styling videos we will show you the different ways of wearing so all you, these you, items. you should try this on then as an overshirt yeah and no, i can pop it on yeah. as an, i don't have to yeah. find some jeans i can pop it on as an overshirt yeah, yeah. yeah. but uh, yeah but i love it as a dress so if you if you can fill it out a bit more and you're short like me it's going to look it's going to make a great summer dress yeah and a great popover as well yeah. you know when yeah. we are on holiday yeah. even if it is yeah. in the uk the neck, yeah. just to chuck over yeah. so especially if you're you know if you're carrying weight in the tummy and the hips area it's um it's a, a coverall but without uh, drowning you yeah. and it moves it swings and it's really lovely yeah. lovely, Feels lovely uh cloth right. to wear so i'm now going to try this on so that is the zebra pattern skirt ladies which is priced and is 56 pounds. i may not come on camera <laughs> <laughs> do you want to take the black one i should um... is it the tearing Take the black one. Take the black one. No, it, it's just not a good look on me. Um, if it was... See if you like the black one. She might not come on the camera, ladies. Let's see if there's any more questions. Hi, Katie. Hi, Sue. Um, now, I'm slightly panicking because, uh, as usual, we didn't think this one through too clearly, and I'm wearing trousers, not jeans. So if Donna wants me to wear an over that's an overshirt i need to grab some jeans so what i'm going to do is when she comes on camera next i'm going to disappear and well if, um, if put you some try jeans the together on first if you try a dress on i first, think they're over here they'll be fine i can find the jeans while yeah. You're, yeah right so this is she's just popped on one of our basic t-shirts in black so uh, the basic tees will be online very very soon this uh, skirt has actually got a zip fastening. Yeah, so there's no elastic. I so there's no elastic. elastic and um, it, so it, it fits into the waist. She's in a size 10, I think. Right. This is why I won't. That is completely wrong for me. So if that's Come and show them here. Come, come and here. That was how I would wear it. Right. right, you talk about that and show why it's wrong. Can okay, so this is something that I knew this is wrong for me. I knew that looking at it and I'm being brave coming on camera in it because 
it's doing nothing for me except make me look like an um, 10 years older than I am and a hundred and more a hundred and, and, and like this is how not to wear your yeah. tiered skirts yeah. ladies watch listen yeah. and learn yeah. if we see any of you wearing your tiered skirts like this mm. you're sacked as artichoke but you girls. see it just goes to show that even Sarah didn't believe me I, I looked at it and I knew it was wrong for me so I or, or I'm wrong for this item mm. So um, if I wear a maxi skirt, because my body is so short, I have to wear a maxi skirt from here. I, I, need, I need to lengthen my body to get away with it. So that's what I normally do, but it's not working with this skirt. And the reason I do that, I'll show you, is because if I was to tuck it in and it cuts me in half, let's just flatten it, it cuts me in half, <coughs> at completely the wrong place. Look, look. You do look like a bag of spans, I look, I, I, I look awful. I, I knew. I'm being very brave coming on camera. So if you... But if Christine put this on... she look bad. She'd look amazing in it. So it's not the skirt. It's The skirt is lovely and it's swishy and it's lovely. It's just completely wrong for me. Style and pattern. Everything is wrong about it for my body shape. So right okay and i'm going to get it off right now so you're going to take this, but then you'll see it on sarah and it'll be completely different well i'm hoping it looks lovely on me yeah I have bought one for or me. we need to get christine to wear it well christine is back tomorrow ladies so um tomorrow she's coming in just for a day to help us price everything up and then we're really hoping that uh, when we open in April we can begin to start getting her back on a regular basis although she's very sensibly saying just hang far until it actually happens no. because actually every time we get her back we go into another bloody lockdown so perhaps we should just not mention Christine coming back because it jinxes us so yeah, but it will be lovely to have her back. She's actually styling some of the Liebling jeans that we've had delivered. Um, we've sent a couple of pairs out to Chris and Sandy, who you will know are um, one of a couple of our lovely models. They've tried uh, the Lieblings on and actually they've bought both the pairs they tried on. <laughs> um, and Christine is trying them on in the shop tomorrow. She's gonna do a little video. And then what I'm gonna do is collate the three videos together and um, do a blog so that you can see how our Liebling jeans look on uh, women who have bottoms and thighs so they are the same material they're even stretchier than the magic stretch but they cut like a julia so they've got the fixed waistband and then they've got a bottom and a thigh cut into them so the blog will be up very very soon oh donna can i just say that all those ladies that came into the shop last year looking for skirts for the summer that maxi dress will be lovely. It's so That maxi skirt, yeah. yeah. You look lovely in that. Right. Do you like it? Yeah, I'm loving come it. In, come yeah. on, talk to them whilst I go and grab some of the sizes. That well, I've actually, got did you look at, at. Right, so this is called the Spirograph Tunic Dress. Mm -hmm. It's £85. Right, okay. So this I feel lovely in. I've got the boots in. Um, the. It, I want to say it's coming from, right, the only thing that's wrong in it for me, I'm loving it, but why it's wrong for me, and so if you've got, if you've got boobs, what it's doing is, hang on, I need to find it, is the A-line, can you see the A-line where the pleat stops? Actually, it's distracting us, I don't think they can hear Right, it. okay, you can't hear the phone, but actually it's not, it's finishing underneath my boobs. So it is, it's fitted here, it's, it's lined, so there you go, it's got a line into it, can you see that? It is lined, luckily, and I'm liking it. I think, I, I think what's putting me off it is that it's hanging from my boobs, yeah, but I think that and it's not giving me you. shape. I think that is, that is the trend, my darling, isn't it? That, that is, is the trend. That may be the trend, but... That's whether you like it or not. I'm going to get changed. Once yeah, but, but you see, I, when I was three... So, f for a lot of my life, I was three stone heavier. And so, my um, I spent my life in clothes that hung off my boobs. So, now, 
you'll very rarely, if you see me in things like this, I've probably got a belt on because for years I have those things. That, that, that's the only clothes I could wear. So the only thing that's putting me off it is the fact it's going back to what I used to wear in that it's hanging off my boobs. So, but if, you, if you're if you not that type of person and you can get over that, then it's lovely. I'm, I'm liking the overall look of it. I, I just... I need to what? I need to run through a forest. It's very, I think it's it's very young looking, isn't it? It's very, very, it's over trendy. Yeah. You just need to have therapy. That's I need it. to have therapy. It's your head, it's got nothing to do with the dress. <laughs> but yes, but you see, for years, I would I would wear clothes. I had a conversation on the phone with some one of you last week about it. Somebody had a conversation with somebody who's just lost an awful lot of weight through lockdown and she's got to get her head around wearing different clothes. And I'm like that. So for years, this is what I would have worn and I would have loved it. And now I'm, uh, I very much like to wear things that are fitted here because if they're fitted here, um, it shows that I, it, it's not just hanging from my boobs with a tummy underneath. So yeah, but I do love it and I like the feel. So it feels lovely. Right, what do we think? This is taking me some time because I'm not sure what sizes to put on. So you're just going to have to chat. Or okay, see. right. Well, let um, me see if there's any questions. Right, questions. Um, Gerald, anybody got any questions for me? Wish it was... Oh, Geraldine, you wish it was longer. Yes, right. It's coming to my knees, but as you know, I'm really short. So, yes. The one we've got coming in... Yeah. Is oh, there's longer. another... One more item. So, the item that's missing... Yeah, is, is similar line to this. Is, is, uh, it's called... I can't remember, some sort of, I think it's called something shirt. Yeah. And it's that material and it's got that floaty feeling, but it is for taller people. Ah, there you go, Geraldine. Did you hear all that? See if you could heard it. So keep your eyes open for that one. Right, Jane, I'm five foot ten. I have to go down here to read it. So if the dresses or tunics will be much shorter on me, what can I wear on my legs as I'm... Oh, I can't see the rest of the question on this phone, Jane. Well, so look for the dr longer dresses that are coming in. But the but it's a good question. And what you can do is if you're if you're really tall, things that I wear can be like tunics. You can turn them into tunics. So I wear a lot of tunics as dresses. So on your legs underneath, I would suggest looking at the Ina 530, which is the crop stamen trouser. And that looks great if you go for a black or even a white, white navy um, or any colour. So have a look at the Styman um, Ina 530s to go under shorter dresses, to turn those dresses into a tunic. We've done that. Oh, we've, yeah. we've, I, ladies in Ely used to do that. There was somebody in Ely who was tall and used to do that with a lot of things and looked amazing. Right, Sarah's ready. So she's going to come on. She hasn't tied the tie in it. That's Did you see I it's got a tie? Won't. You, you won't do it. Right, and see, that's very much you. Right, so I'm not going to tie the tie because I'm not going to. Right, okay. So, ladies, everything that Donna has been wearing actually is a tunic. She just wears them as a dress. So when we start styling, we, you know, I'll be wearing things as a tunic. She'll be wearing them as a dress. So we've got here... The uh, batik shirt dress is £74. I'm going to come into camera so that you can see this is where the waist is. So again, probably I need a margin, but I don't think I, don't think I need a different bra. I think it's falling okay from the waist. Yep. But what I haven't done, can you see, it's now, it's got some sort of thing that you would tie around here. Which clearly but I you're, wouldn't. you're never going to do that. I'm not going to do that. So I haven't done it up. But and what actually, you can do, but oh, I can do it. Do you it can at do the it back. back. So if you want it to look more wasted, but you don't want to tie so it. So can you front, see? It's just giving me shape. But yeah. the reality is, just, my boobs are too big. Right. But so if you, you got a normal loose. bust, you could pull it in, and then it would fit there. But you know, it's just not going over yeah. near my boobs. Yeah. So I would wear this. I would take off the belt loops because it's got pockets. And just wear it as a really nice, relaxed um, dress. And I think this is gorgeous. This is right, you, personally, this is right up my street. It's also got um, the little notch, the little buttons here so that these sleeves can be rolled 
to just above your um, elbows. So this is definitely got a thumbs up from yeah, me. I, 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 I knew, but I, I knew summer. that was going to be for you. Yeah, yeah. and yeah. I actually I don't normally wear long. And it looks great with the flats. And, oh yeah, we've, I've done it with trainers. I'm just going to do everything with these um, Converse's ladies. I don't know if you can see the Converse's because we moved the camera back so we could accommodate the mirror. But I'm just going to wear everything with Converse's and this has definitely got the thumbs up for me. Yep. The next one I'm going to try on is this snake midi right, so you I'll just need that. to give me a couple of seconds because i'm not sure what sizes i should be fitting right we've had um something like this in the past and sarah has sarah owns um a dress very similar james to Lakeland. this it's a james lakeland one completely different color but still um the snake print and it's still maxi so I think this is going to look, uh, this is very uh, right up her street. So those of you that we had a lot of ladies coming into the shop after that dress that Sarah had. So if you were one of those, then grab this quickly, I would. Right, so this one is called the Snake Midi Dress. Um, it is £85. So it is button through is it button through all the way let me see yeah it's button through all the way it is it's not lined and it's made of let me have a look it's made of a hundred percent viscose and um, it's very lightweight so it's going to be cool in the summer because those of you who think you can't wear viscose in the summer, um, we, we disagree, don't we? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I love the neckline in it. I, lo I love a notch neckline. So, yeah, right, I'm going to let Sarah come on now. So here am I wearing the snake midi dress. I'm in the 14. And actually, I think I probably could have gone down a size. So these clearly are a generous cut, ladies. And what I like about this, I'm going to come right up to camera and show you my boobs. Can you see that it, I don't know if you can see, it's got the uh, pin tuck pleating. So um, if it was a bit smaller like this, it's a very flattering cut so that it comes into the waist and then it flows out. And then right at the bottom, it's got a tear. So this tiered look taking us back to the nine oh actually there's two tiers the first is here and then the second is below the knee taking us back to the 1970s um and again it's that very oversized relaxed look which is a very very strong trend for this summer ladies um because it's viscose it won't be sweaty betty it does need pressing so that it hangs properly but I think this is yet another gorgeous, really easy dress to wear. And if we just grab Ooh. a jacket, this is how we oh, this is how we start doing wearing them now, ladies. And just let me pull it in so it fits me a bit better. So this is how we start wearing our summer dresses now is just bung the dark denim jacket over. I know that we go on and on and on about these jackets, ladies, but it's like the summer equivalent of a leather jacket. You really should have one in your wardrobe because you will wear it all year and it will just help you bring forward some of your summer frocks. And actually, Donna's popped her denim jacket over the shorter skirt. So I'm getting changed now into the next item. Yeah. Um, right, any more questions? Going back, is the snake dress navy or black? Right, snake dress is... Oh, oh, it's here. So the snake dress is a navy. I'll come really close to the camera for you. It's, um, it's a blue, it's not even a navy, it's, a, it's very much a blue. There we go. Can you see? Does it... Sorry, we, we, we're going to try and get better lighting for doing these videos, but we need to remember to come close for you to pick up the colour. So that's a blue. Right, any other questions? Um, 
I do. G Geraldine likes that one. The snake one. Any more questions while I'm here uh, ready? If you, even if you've asked a question or, already, I can uh, read it now. Let's have a look. Does it have pockets, Liz? No. Hello, Rosie. Uh, no, it doesn't have pockets. No pockets. Uh, Rosie, if you've only just started watching, you need to um, see the dress that I was wearing at the start of this. That's the, safari uh, the safari dress, Rosie, is very you. Um, I can see Rosie in the khaki one, don't you think? Or even the gorgeous uh, new, new colour. So, Rosie, you need to look at the safari dress. It's very you dress. Right, this I'm loving. This is very Sarah. <laughs> see, that's how it should look. So, Sarah's now wearing the, the skirt. So, let me get it. So, this is the batik tiered skirt. It's, it's um, a sort of an air force blue there's the color and here's the reveal Ta -da! so here i am in the batik uh cotton skirt it's 52 pounds i think Let me check. it's got an elasticated waist 56. 56 pounds i'm in the size 12 i would normally take a size 12 below the the, the chest um plenty of room to eat your dinner again it's got the three tiers now this is really going back to Pomodoro's roots. For years and years and years, they were known for these ethnic prints and also um, for the sort of hippie chick look. And as you flap this skirt around, you can smell India. It's, um, it's elastic gorgeous. all the way around. It's isn't elasticated it? all the way around. And then I said, ladies, that when we put the collection together, we've got the entire collection in mind. So what I've done is I've teamed it up with the pointel top from K Design. Don't know if you can see the little uh, lace pattern detailing in there, which I actually bought to go and sit with this range. I can't see how much that is. This is online too. That's because you haven't priced it Not yet. Not priced. We're, We're having, having a whole price. day of pricing next week. <laughs> <laughs> because we don't need to be ready to open a shop soon. So this is online and it is just a great, great outfit. Would I wear these clunky trainers with it? No, because I think I look like the child catcher. I would have a pair of little pretty flip-flops uh, to wear with this skirt and we've got them coming in. Would you wear the overshirt with that? No. No, because right. I just think it would bulk me out too much. Okay. So I just think that I need to, you know, because I... You'd got, wear the denim jacket jackets, with it. Yeah. Right, no, should okay. I do that? Oh, no, the denim jacket's in there. But no, I would pop that denim jacket over yeah. now because um, I need to keep everything And why up have here. you tucked in? Why wouldn't... Can, can I see what it looks like out? Because I've just done what you did. But, but what if you... See, I like that. Right. Can I, can I just... But it won't stay like that. If you just... Uh, it will stay like that for that 35 looks, seconds. I like that. That looks lovely. Yeah, but if I, in real life, it's it wouldn't not going to stay like, that. Stay like right, that, which okay. is why I just tuck it in. Right, okay. And then it just shortens, you know, just gives me a bit of height. Okay. And what I must say with these skirts, ladies, is, you know, it is so easy to move into granny mode. You do need to think carefully about your top half. Keep it fitted. Yeah. And keep it snug. Yeah. 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 Um, so yeah, love this skirt. Uh, am I trying this one on too? I am, aren't I? Uh, I've got Ooh. the trousers, and I've got. I'm going to do the black zebra. Sh I'm going to do the zebra skirt next. Do you want uh, what size trousers have you got in there? I've got two. I've lost my glasses. Okay. Amongst all this plastic, <laughs> okay. can you grab the? Tw I'll get you to that. I'll get you to grab the twelve trousers when I come on camera because. We might find... Right, that, I'm uh, sort of thinking I want to try those trousers on now, so next time Sarah's on, I might go and try those trousers because... Oh, well, I'll, give, I'll grab them. Yeah, I'll because I love the I love the pattern, um, and I wasn't sure what it was going to be like, so what I'm going to do is I'll try those um, trousers on for all you short ladies uh, when Sarah is next on. Love the batik. Do you have any other garments in this print? In the petite, so yes, there's just the, the dress and the, the skirt. Dress. So the skirt and the dress. Um, Helena, just the skirt and the dress, yes. Can Sarah try the zebra tunic? Yes, yes. we'll get the zebra tunic. 
in her size. So I'll go and find um, sizes in a moment. Yeah, we've yeah. got a slight hitch in that Sarah has lost her glasses. We're right. I so might she can't see. So what sizes so, do you want me to find for you? I just need to pretend to do this up. Right. Oh, that's, I love that. That's looking lovely. Right, I'm going to swap and I'm going to go off and find sizes if I can rem find where Sarah's put right, them. Right, so here you are. You need these trousers. Yeah, I'm going to try those on. Right, so this is me, ladies, in the um, zebra. <laughs> <laughs> Donna's just crawled what? underneath the camera. <laughs> this is me in the zebra skirt. Obviously not with these trainers. Um, I'm just going to run and see if I can find my little sandals that I would actually wear this with. Can I find my sandals? Talk right. amongst yourselves. Right, so this is how I would wear this skirt. If we just lose the um, trainers and just put... Oh, this brings me on to feet. Oh my God, Michaela, I used that foot mask and it has transformed my feet so they can come out in public so i would uh, probably wear um this uh dress with my flat form sandals or um some black flat um flip-flops because again wearing them with trainers just makes me look like the child catcher above the waist i've got one of our basic t-shirts they're not online yet, it's a short sleeve version. We have them in every single colour under the sun and um, they're going to retail at about £12, I think. But in a week or two, they should be online. There's absolutely no point in me looking to see about questions because I can't actually see anything till I locate my glasses. Right. Tell me where those the other sizes are in the, the tunic in, um, in that. All over there. Right, They're I'll going go and find there. those for um, if you when you're trying the next thing on. Right, these... Are you coming back on with the trousers? Well, I think... I think they are obviously too long for me, but I think they're going to look, um, I'll let you go off. They're too big here. They're too big every, yeah, but if you are a little bit, look, if you're not Sarah's size and you're wondering about these, they're too long on me, you'd have to shorten them, but I don't mind them actually. If you want a loose pair of trousers, they're elasticated, they have got pockets. If you want, and they're lovely, they're lightweight, so they're gonna be lovely and cool. They're, they're, not, um, they're not great on me, but that's me. So if you're looking for trousers, cool summer trousers, uh, loose fitting, I know a lady phoned me last week and this is exactly what she was looking for. So if you don't mind the zebra print, um, these are gonna be a great summer trouser. Um, right, that if I wanted to wear them, they'd be like a palazzo pants with a heel. I could probably I think the pockets are making them look big there. I think it's the pockets. So, but obviously, if you've got bigger hips than me, those those would hide. Right, so I'm just going to dash off and find for Sarah. So I'm finding the tunic. I'm not sure. I want to try the zebra Somebody print wants tunic. you to try the zebra print yeah, tunic. Yeah, you bring that back, and then I'll wear this stone stone tunic now. Yep. And then I can try the zebra tunic on camera. Then I can go off. And, and you want to try trousers, these trousers. And then we're done. Yeah, okay. Right, what's, I'm going to disappear. Talk amongst yourselves. Right, so, so I'm back in my jeans and um, a white basic t shirt. So I've got the stonewash jeans, the 1913s on, and um, a basic white t shirt above them. I'm just trying to unbutton this very unsuccessfully by touch. There are swathes of plastic in that changing room. Just <laughs> taking stuff off. Do you want to unwrap them for me? Yeah, I will do. And then I can just try. So I've got you a twelve in the trousers, and I've got you a fourteen. Yeah, in the you could just take that tunic off, right. and I could wear that now, couldn't I? Just show the ladies. Right, if I just pop this over my head, then I can fiddle with more buttons afterwards. This one will go over your head as well. Right, 
So this is not a grey colour on me. In fact, it's hideous. So um, does I don't really do this any favours whatsoever because of my colouring. If I slowly, slowly undo the buttons for you. So you'll have to imagine my colouring on Sarah's so shape. <laughs> so just stick my that, up. ladies, we're sorted because if you've got a darker colouring, this is going to be fabulous. And we're there. So actually, the style I love. I just love this as a summer coat. I think it's gorgeous. I love the detailing um, on the bib. I love the fact that it's three quarter sleeves. It's just that I'm not doing it any favours. But if you have Donna's colouring, it is going to look stunning on you. And if you're not confident enough to wear it as a dress, and actually I if, if this if this shirt was in blue, it would be coming home with me. If it was in a denim blue, I'd be wearing it. So now I've just put the cuff on my jeans. I would wear this as a dress, I would wear it as a coat, and then what I would do is I would wear it done up as a tunic as well. Um, it's just the colour. I'm not doing it any favours at all. But, if you have a darker complexion, go with it ladies. And I just need, have you got the tunic got there in my yeah. size? Yeah. So this is the zebra tunic over shirt. And again, this is better, I think, again, not wearing it. This should not be worn with a white t-shirt. It should be worn with an ecru one. But if you imagine that I've got a nice ecru uh, t-shirt underneath this and a big statement piece of jewellery, I would not wear this as a skirt, because as a dress, because it is ending quite a long way above my knees. And then I'm really sorry, ladies, about this. I cannot believe I haven't got a spare pair of glasses somewhere. Oh, yeah. But laboriously, I'm getting this undone by touch. I've got Donna's trousers. Uh, trousers. Oh, my God. Why do we do these videos? I've got Donna's glasses on now <coughs> so that I can actually see what I'm doing. Each of these videos is like us going to the gym. And again, now it can you see it can be worn undone as a coat so with a lovely ecru top underneath your eagle six a toes some nice heels ladies it would look fab it would look fab with these stonewashed jeans and a black t-shirt underneath and a really great piece of statement jewelry or you could do the whole monochrome look with an overshirt underneath and um, now I'm going to try more trousers on, aren't I? Oh, I love that. Yeah, I no, I think it's really nice. Yeah. So I'm now going to disappear. Donna's coming back. So you're just going to slip so these trousers on? So I'm just going to move trousers on. But I'm going to wear a black top because I just think that would look better. Right. So. There we go. I can find your glasses here. Put right. your glasses back. Sorry, I'm back. Right, any more questions? Let me look for questions. Right, are you selling those t-shirts you have on details please yes the t-shirts that we have on are called our basic t-shirts are they online yet no. not online yet going to be online um but if you want to um if you want some you can give us a call so messages messages on here they come in i haven't found any smalls they're still all in the box but they we have them in uh, medium small through to double XL, XXL. Um, the medium I'm wearing a medium here so the medium is coming up as a large 10 small 12 so 10 12 medium if you want a more fitted look I, w I would be able to fit in the small um, I'll be honest with you I just actually want to check that I'm not lying and that I did find a small let me just check this is really tricky can you see what that is Sarah Not without your glasses, 
So you are in... Am I in a... Medium. Yeah, I am. I wasn't lying, so I'm in a medium. So we'll go back again. Just wanted to check I wasn't lying. So I will fit a small, but um, if you, it depends what look you want. If you want fitted or if you want loose. Right. Oh, loving that. So here am I, loving this oh outfit. Um, I've got the zebra palazzos on. They have a fixed waistband at the front, partially elasticated at the back. Uh, sorry, bras all over the place with the quick change. Um, and again, I've teamed it up with the K-Design um, top that's got the little lace dealing in the neckline. And I think we've finished plain dressing up now, haven't we? We've been through everything, ladies. Uh, we can now have a large gin and tonic. Um, and roll on next week is all I can say. You can see how much I love these videos. <laughs> Don has gone and dug in the box for some right, reason. Right, the lady that was asking about the t-shirts, um, we have them in red. We have them in a lovely Air Force blue. We have them in a pale blue. We have them in navy. We have them in bluebell. We have, we them, have them in black. In coral. We, we have them in coral. Pink. We have them in a fuchsia turquoise. pink. We have turquoise. Navy. So uh, lots of colours. Baby pink. Lots of colours. Those are going to go online when Sarah gets a moment to do it. Um, not in the next couple of weeks. We've got to open up the shop and concentrate on that first. But if you if you really want them, um, messages. messages, you can get them before they go online. Okay, ladies. So thank you for being patient with us. I feel that this is our most chaotic reveal so far. So let's see what Sukarna brings us next Monday. As far as this week is concerned, come back and see us on Thursday at 4.30 in the afternoon. What we're going to be doing on Thursday is talking about uh, jeans and the boyfriend cut. We've had lots of requests for boyfriend jeans and we just want to chat through our take on boyfriend jeans um, and how you can wear them. So we're going to do our usual thing of 10 ways to wear boyfriend jeans on Thursday. On Sunday we are going to meet a very special article artichoke even girl her name is sarah morgan she started out life as a reporter she then had kids and trained to be a, a personal style and color consultant um, we'll talk about how she rather lost her faith doing that um, and reinvented herself as um, a, a purveyor of pre-loved garments then Thank God, just before COVID, she actually decided to stop being a shopkeeper and went back to doing the degree she should have done at 18. So she's now doing um, a textile degree. So you'll see that, you know, clothing and textiles have played a big part in her life. The reason I love her is because she doesn't terrify me with rules. She's the only stylist apart from Trini that I've ever met or, or listened to who says, these are the rules and now you know what they are, you wear what you want. So we're gonna meet her on Sunday. She's a real hoot. Oh, I forgot to tell you, she's a chalet girl as well. But there's more about that on Sunday. Thank you so much, ladies, for watching us. I hope that you love the Pomodoro collection for this season as much as we do. And we will catch up with you on Thursday at 4.30 for a styling video on how to wear boyfriend jeans. And that won't be as chaotic because we will have thought about that we one. We will have planned that one. <laughs> See you.